Hello everyone, this is Joel from IT Geek Techs and today I'm going to be showing you how to do a VPN connection and how to check that your VPN connection is active. So what we do is right click the little computer on the lower right hand corner by where the clock is. Okay. And select Open Networking Sharing Center. Now I already have a connection set up for VPN and it's active and I can check the details by going to its properties, clicking the link and then clicking on details. That gives me the setup information for this VPN connection on the remote network. Okay, so this computer can now access information on the other network because it's connected via a VPN connection and is using the username and password that needs <clears throat> that was provided from this computer so that it can um, have a connection access valid all the time. Clicking and change adapter settings gives you a list of all the connections available for this computer. This is the local area connection which is the cable that's working. Uh, the ProLine VPN connection that's already connected. I could disconnect it by right clicking and select disconnect or view its status which is what we already saw. To create a new connection, select connect to a network. I'm sorry, uh, let's see, did I do this right? Okay. Set up a network connection, that's what I meant to do. Create to a work, <coughs> excuse me, connect to workplace. Next use my internet connection as a VPN and here we enter the information the, of the remote network now um, this is just the information on the outside that will create the actual connection there is two settings, It'll, there's the external setting and the internal setting we're accessing the external setting, the internal setting would be anything that's number less 192.168.0 or in this case 10.001. I'm just using this number right now. Um, I won't save it. I just want to go to the next window. Under username you would put the username that you're given uh, in the domain, your password, you can show the characters, and save this information. Domain, I would always put the domain but you don't really have to. That's given to you as you log in through the VPN. Okay, well that's how you create a connection and that's how you make sure that your connection is running. If your connection was not running, this, I'm sorry, your VPN connection was not active, you would see this as disconnected and this box would be grayed out. If I were to disconnect it right now, it would stop the video. So, Okay, thank you very much. If you have any questions, we are available at itgeektechs.com, info at itgeektechs.com. Uh, Facebook, LinkedIn, Google+, and Twitter. Uh, look for us, uh, IT Geek Techs. Our phone number is 760-705-4735. Thank you.